Hi everyone, so I'm back today to share with you another journal that I've made and this is another fabric journal. I'm not going to make any more for a while now with the fabric covers. I'm going to jump onto something else. Um, it's very similar to the ones that I've showed you. There's just different papers in this one. Um, I've still used papers from Artie Mays, uh, Tsunami Rolls, The Old Design Shop, uh, My Porch Prints, uh, Shabby Dabby Doo trying to think Christie Art Designs they're all the places that I've pulled things out from to make this journal and this is the fabric it's got little bits on it Oops. Uh, and that's the cover the image here that I've used is from my porch prints and the journal measures eight and a quarter by five inches it has one signature there is 76 pages front and back um, it's all been sewn again uh, onto two layers of cardstock one of them uh, is coffee dyed which is on the inside we've got eyelets and string as a closure this one will be listed in my shop now the papers that I used for this uh, the, like the main pages are from Artie Mays and it's the floral collage uh, so go over and check that out <clears throat> so here again I've just been making the little clusters and I have got a tutorial on that but so does many other people as well you just kind of find your own style when you start to make them so this is a freebie from Artie Mays you can find that on her website and on her Facebook group which is Artie Mays and Friends this I don't know where that came from I think that might be my porch prints uh, this is Tsunami Rose this is I think it's Christy Art Designs and this is Tsunami Rose little uh, a monthly calendar We've got a doily, a things to do page, a fabric tab. This is the old design shop with some crocheted trim. Done some stamping. You can see that's still wet there. I've literally just put that on. Um, these are from Shabby Dabby Doodle. I'll just make sure I'm in frame. They're called um, Curator's Flowers. Let me just see because I've still got it up somewhere. It is called Curator's Collection Flowers. <clears throat> uh, just got some ephemera here, Tsunami Rose, the old design shop, and like I said, the old design shop on the blog has lots of freebies that you can use, and they also have an Etsy store, so we go over and check out both. This uh, some lined paper there, this is from Tsunami Rose, Artie Maze, another little pocket here, the uh, the little word sentiment on here is blessed and it's from my porch prints the butterflies from Artie Mays and it's got a little the it's like a pearlescent um, little bling I've run out of my other big bling or well I don't know if I've run out of it I can't find them um, there's not much left of it anyway but <laughs> I couldn't find it today when I come in here so I just made some journal cards using these images which I found via Pinterest Put a little bit of fabric there <clears throat> Uh, this is Artie Mays. I can't remember what kit that's from. A little bit of fabric there as well. This is Tsunami Rose. Uh, I think this might be Cameo Shop or Christie Art Designs. Another doily. This is from Tsunami Rose. The old design shop. Shabby Dabby Doodle. Some stamping. Uh, some squared paper. Artie Mays. That's the floral collage kit. <clears throat> Here we've got another pocket and I've used I used one sheet to make six pockets in the journal <clears throat> um, just obviously cutting it into the sizes that I want and this is from the um, floral collage kit you get three background sheets with that as well so this is a freebie from Artie Mays it's been backed onto cardstock again her uh, Facebook group or her website Artie Mays again this is Artie Mays 2, a doily, Tsunami Rose, Fabric Tab, the old design shop, journal card here. Now I can't remember where they came from. It could either be um, the Graphics Fairy or the old design shop. Can't remember. Some nice markings here again with the uh, coffee dine center of the signature 
another journal card again. I can't remember if that's from the, the Graphics Fairy or um, the Old Design Shop. But if you go on to both um, and have a look and see, uh, I think you would put in like uh, vintage ledger, vintage receipts, that kind of thing, and it all comes up. Uh, some more writing space, the old design shop. Uh, things to do is from Tsunami Rose and then the fabric tab. These have got hummingbirds on them. A doily. A tag from Artie Mays. That's a freebie. Again, I've, I've done another little kind of cluster thing here. Actually, it's just layering. It's not a cluster. Artie Mays. That's Artie Mays as well. There's some nice positive quotes, um, which was really handy, especially at this, what we're all dealing with at the moment. Uh, I love that page. Love them roses. They put me in mind of um, when, I know I went through a phase of buying flowers from Wild Orchid Crafts and I Am Roses. That's what they put me in mind of every time I see them. I don't use that kind of thing anymore. Um, so I'm stamping. Shabby Dabby Doodle, some crochet to trim, nearly run out of that and the seller that I buy it from has got none in stock at the moment so I'm hoping to get it back in stock soon because I do, I do use a lot of that. Uh, this is from the image I find on Pinterest. Now if you go onto Pinterest and put in things like vintage ladies, Victorian ladies, um, you'll get a bundle of things go come up and when when things do come up scroll down because then you find more <laughs> that's what i find i find more looking through the scrolly bits down the bottom than i actually do when i do in my search that's from tsunami rose and that's some hummingbirds on there uh tsunami rose as well arty maze and this little label here says lovely butterfly from arty maze and one of them little pearlescent um, bling pieces. <clears throat> this is the old design shop. And this is Salami Rose. I do use a lot of the same things like in my journals. It's because I've got them and you know I, I do find it hard to find um, original ephemera like vintage ephemera i do have some but then i'm scared to use it because then when i use it i haven't got it <laughs> uh this is tsunami rose i know a lot of people that you know when, once you've got something you hold it you don't want to use it shabby dabby doo -da. i do love them little frames with the flowers they're so pretty and you get f uh, four sheets with that and um they come in all different sizes so and um, what did I call them again? Uh, Curator's Collection Flowers. Tsunami Rose Fabric Tab Doily. I squashed one there. Another little um, cluster that I made. I've actually printed out a lot of the um, little things to do more clusters with. I might take them indoors and get the hubby to help me. <laughs> See if he'll help out making the clusters because I'm sure he could do them. I'm sure we could. Uh, this is uh, Artie Maze. This is Artie Maze as well, and that's a freebie. And that's the one you, that you get all the the collection of little butterflies. You get them in that size and a little bit smaller and a little bit smaller than that. So not only do you get three tags, you get um, a nice little collection of butterflies. So, uh, Tsunami Rose. And I don't know who that's from. Christie Art Designs or something like that. It generally is them. Um, again, I think that's Christie Art Designs as well. I think that's, is that the cluster? It's the same one I used in that little cluster here, only that shrunk right down. That is normal size, which is roughly about an ATC size, I think. And even that, I think has, has shrunk down just a tiny, tiny bit. All right, that's, I bent that back accidentally. And there we go, the back page. So that is the journal. And like I said, um, this will be listed in my shop if you're interested. And this will be the last like fabric one in this size that I'll be doing for a while. I do want to do my big, the big journal using the Nature's Remedy 
like it. I've been saying I'm going to do that for about two or three weeks now and I haven't got around to doing it. So hopefully this week will be the week that I start that. Um, although I do have one of a, 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 a prep to journal and it's all printed out. I was going to do another one of these, but then I've, I've kind of gone off the idea now because I've done four and that's enough for me. Um, so yeah, hopefully I'll get on with something else this week. Hope you're all having a great weekend. It's bank holiday weekend here, um, so which means Monday. Not that it makes a lot of difference for some of us because we're all stuck at home anyway, um, but it's going to be a good day here. So if it's a good day wherever you are, have a lovely day. And I will be back soon with another video. Bye.